What's up, second grade? How are you doing? This is uh, Mr. Lloyd. Uh, I am excited to uh, send this message out to you today. Um, first off, I want to uh, welcome you back to our unofficial uh, back to school uh, open house. I know we can't do it in person this year, and that's fine. We are uh, going to do it digitally. So here we go. Um, first off, I want to welcome each and every one of you to my classroom. I am so excited to see kids' face again. It's been hard not seeing anybody since March. And so that first day when you walk in, I cannot wait to see you all. Uh, before I tell you, moms and dads and kids, some of the things uh, just for the first day, I just want to introduce myself. Um, of course, uh, my name is Mr. Lloyd. A lot of times you'll hear Mr. L. Um, who am I? I want to tell you first, I have uh, been a resident. I've grown up here in Grand Forks for most of my life. Um, I have also taught second grade for the last 11 years, so I know a little bit about it, and I'm so excited to see all the things that you uh, are going to accomplish this year in second grade. What do I love to do? That's a great question. I'm glad you asked. Well, first and foremost, I love to go to the lake every summer. Uh, I spent a lot of time at the lake with friends this year, uh, more than I have in the past, and I've been so thankful and appreciative of that. Of course, uh, you might see up here the ND. I absolutely love to go to UND Sports. You're going to hear a lot about that this year. Um, uh, Mr. Lloyd is kind of a diehard hockey fan, so uh, get ready for some stories because you're going to hear a lot of them. A couple of fun facts about me. Um, you'll notice again, a hat on my head. I wear a hat every single day of my life. And of course, you're going to hear all year long again that the one thing that I love to eat all the time is pizza. So if you're a pizza lover, we're going to live, get along really well and you're going to hear about my pizza stories all the time. So boys and girls, I'm so pumped to have you in class this year. I just wanted to show you the classroom a little bit. I want to talk about the things that you need to bring on the first day. Don't stress about it. I know some of us have some worries or concerns. We're not going to worry about anything this year. We're just going to take it one day at a time, and we're going to do great. So for bringing things on the first day of school, I know we always have a lot of supplies and things like that. We don't want to overwhelm you this year. Uh, so parents, if you could help get your kids ready to go for the first day by just getting a few basic things for the first day, and then we can bring the other things on the other days, that would be super appreciative. Um, children, I would love if you have a set of headphones. Bring your headphones with you on the first day. We will be using those each and every day. Um, if you have a water bottle, please bring a water bottle that seals and closes up not one with the straws. We don't like those. Those spill easy. But just a regular water bottle that you can squirt water out of and drink. Um, well, that's what we'll be using for getting water every day. Um, so if you can bring a water bottle, that would be greatly appreciated. And then the school supplies. Just bring a pencils. Bring some pencils, um, a couple notebooks, crayons, markers, just the basic things um, for the first day. Um, maybe stuff that will fit in your backpack. But don't bring all those extra bags of stuff on the first day. Just bring it little by little each day um, until we have it all here. Uh, whatever fits in your backpack, that'd be great. Um, we're not going to overload you and have tons and tons of stuff. So when you walk in, kiddos, we'll be able to bring your backpacks with you. Just set it on the back of your chair um, until I'll show you where we're going to keep those things. So uh, bring those things. That's, that's kind of all I've had to say about coming on the first day um, when you do get to class. Who would love to see it? I agree with you. Boys and girls, I know some of you know where Mr. Lloyd's classroom is. That's fantastic. Maybe you've come to visit. You've picked some stuff up. You drop stuff off. I wanted to let you see a little bit that we do have a normal classroom. Everything is spaced out nicely. We're going to be able to do things together in the classroom. Our desks will not be together this year, which is just fine. But we do have space where we can uh, be apart with each other and do that. If you're not sure where the room is, it is 125. So feel free to swing over and uh, find that room. If you can't find it, I will be here to help you on that first day. Can't wait to see you. Hope you're all doing well. I'll see you on Monday morning. Take care, everybody. Can't wait.